What's up, Dookies? It's Jake Boy Devler. We're back with some more Pokemon Radical Red. Hardcore Dexnav Randomizer. The next one, we made it all the way to fucking Rock Tunnel in Route 10. Um, and now we have to push forward to try to get hidden abilities. We're so close yet so far. We have three more battles to go. Three more mini bosses to go before we can get there and actually do something with them. But uh, if we do that, we get a lot of encounters. We can go fight Surge, go fight Erica. But today, we're probably just going to try to get try to beat those three guys. Check our hidden abilities out. Check our encounters out. And that's probably going to be it, honestly. Nothing too crazy for the day. So we got to get the first team pulled up. Um, There's that one. And why is this one not going? Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Don't know why it's not there. It should be there. It should be there. Cool, there it is. All right, so it's this fight right here. Rebombi. It's these guys. Okay, we went over this a little bit yesterday. Nothing too crazy. Oh, um, we did go over a couple things. I think I said I was gonna bring. I think here's the team I said I was gonna think of. I think I was gonna bring in Toad Scroll for Rebombi because he's the only thing that has um, rapid spin, which means I can get rid of the fucking the, you know the, the fucking the stupid things, you know, the, the sticky webs. I can get rid of the sticky webs, which is nice. And I get a plus to, uh, get a plus to my special defense, my special attack, because it is going to be... Rabombi does have less special defense, or more defense, so I will be able to get a buff to my special defense. So that's going to be nice. Um, and I don't, I don't, I mean, I, I don't really, it doesn't take me out too much. Just watch if I go... I go plus one of my special attack because he is download. I have download, so it's gonna give me a better whatever whatever, whatever stats better for me. That's what it's gonna do, and I do decent to this thing. It's gonna go sticky webs. I go rapid spin, hundred percent time. I go rapid spin, hundred percent time, it's just so I can get rid of that. And I give my citrus berry so I can keep if I can eat a couple moves. If it wants to keep coming in, I can keep coming in against it. It's probably gonna rapid spin. It's probably gonna sticky web and then and then U turn, unless it's unless it's not gonna U turn as I rapid spin. I mean, it could. I'm I'm just gonna keep rapid spinning honestly. That's what I'm gonna do. That's my goal is you can handle it. Um, for both a land, both a land. That's a little scary. Um, Rampardos. Actually, we'll do Rampardos first. Rampardos is level 36. I'm thinking of bringing Ferrothorn for it because he resists and he's really bulky. If I go plus defense minus speed, I go Citrus Berry. I can KO. I can KO him with Power Whip. So it's actually not terrible. I can go Citrus Berry. I can go U plus defense minus speed because I, I don't need to be fast. And I just go in and go for Power Whip. Power Whip just kills him in one hit. I could get myself cut actually too instead of Metal Claw, but it doesn't really matter right now. Bulldoze doesn't, doesn't do that much. Bulldoze won't do as much as Power Whip. Power Whip super strong. 120 is really good. 90 is what I'm scared of, but I think, I think I'm going to go ahead and keep a Citrus on me. I'm going to go ahead and keep the Citrus on me. Go plus... Plus deep. Okay, get out of the way. Out of the man. Man, what are you doing? -y? Go plus defense minus special attack. Actually, minus speed. Because I don't need to be fast. I don't need to be fast. Um, I'm the slowest thing in the world. Go plus defense so I can eat some moves because I resist it. I resist the head smash. If he wants to go for power up punch, as I swap in, for example, he'll do 55% to me. To 65%. Which means he'll do about 30 plus that. Which is pretty dangerous. Um, I think I have to just do it. I think I have to stay. I have to just use you, and the power up. The power up's gonna hit. The power up is going to hit. It's gonna kill you. We're gonna be good. Rampart of the answer right here. Um, for Craw, what's his name? Claw for the Claw. I'm gonna bring my Lodic. Cause my Lodic actually walls him pretty well. Um, Claw gets walled. Because I have really high special defense. Um, let me see here. 36 against my low tick. 36. I have sheer force. So Shy Shock will do a little bit of damage. I have recover and I have captivate. I'm faster than Claw. So I can always swap in on Claw. Take whatever it's going to do. And then I go for captivate right away. And captivate, if, if he's a male, as I'm a female. Because captivate only works. I have captivate, right? Yeah, Captivate only works if the foe is the opposite gender. The special attack is harshly lowered. So it's minus two. I can lower a special attack by two right away. And he does nothing to me. And I can recover. I have recovered. 
I go for Psyshock. Shock. I don't go for Water Pulse. I go for Psyshock. Shock. Psy Shock does it just it's gonna kill him in four or five times. I mean, I ain't worried about it honestly. It's just a battle with him. I give myself a Citrus Berry so I can handle things a little more. Not bad. And you're also really good for uh, Mag Cargo as well. Not Mag Cargo, sorry. Mag Mortar. What am I thinking? Mag Mortar because level 36. I can eat a Flamethrower and I, I can eat two Thunderbolts. So I can swap in a Thunderbolt, for example, and go Captivate. If he's a male, I can go Captivate. And he does not, it's now going 25% to me and I have Water Pulse. So I mean, like I can captivate both of these. If they're both males, if Mag Mortar and Claw are males, I can I can just captivate them, and I can I can eat the hits. Otherwise, we have Draco Vish for for Mag Mortar as well. We have Draco Vish for Mag Mortar. Draco, Draco Vish with plus special attack. A Citrus Berry. I can. The only scary thing is with this is that he can flinch me. That's the scariest thing is he could flinch me, which is of course scary, but it's what I have to do. He could flinch me. That's what I gotta do, you know? That's what I gotta do. And then we have... Slacking, I think, was my best bet for... Um... Bofalant? Slacking with a Chillin' Berry. Because... Here's the thing. So as soon as this guy swaps in, he wants to go for Bull Rush. Um, what are we going for? We go for plus defense. Minus. We go that. And so... He wants to go... He, go, he gets Bull Rush. So if I swap in with Slacking... I have a, I would have a chillin berry. He wants to go for head smash. It's his strongest move. Of course, if he doesn't want to, that's fine. Then we then we eat it even better, because head smash is the strongest thing. With a chillin berry, it's gonna do twenty five percent max, and he does a little bit to himself. And then he no longer has his bull rush, and I no longer have my chillin berry. So I come in. I'm faster. I can go for yawn. I can go for slack off. Hammer arm's not bad. Hammer arm plus slacker punch could KO. It's a, it's a low roll. It's a it's probably a low roll to do it. I mean, it's probably really it's mean seventy it's seventy four percent and twenty five. So I mean, like it's a ninety nine percent chance to KO him with going hammer arm and then sucker punch. So I could be fine. And plus, when he's doing damage to himself, it's easily hammer arm plus sucker punch is gonna kill. I have slack off too. I have slack off. So that's the set. I'm gonna go. I'm not gonna bring body slam because it's just hammer arm so strong and and, and sucker punch is so strong. I don't, I, don't, I don't need to, I don't need to go plus plus attack I go I go plus defense with you um, minus special attack and you just do really good you handle him really well you actually handle both land really well because with the chillin berry you come in take the head smash at, at at bull rush really well which means then bull rush is gone he no longer is fast so I'm now faster than you and I just go for hammer arm slow myself down and then I go for sucker punch and he dies. Because he probably goes for head smash multiple times. Or I could slack off. I, I, I could swap in, slack off, go to full health, take the take the head charge damage, and then take it again. He might. So the, only, the only problem with this thing is if he swaps. I probably have to go for head. I probably have to go for hammer arm right away. Because if he swaps out, then I have to swap back in. And I won't be able to... I mean, I guess I'll be faster, but he, he'll always... He'll have his fucking... I just thought of... He'll have his... If he swaps back in and I swap back in on this, he'll have this. With no item? Oh, it only does like 50% to me. Okay. That actually is not that crazy because... It actually is not that crazy. With the bull rush, it's not that much more damage. So it's not even that scary. Okay, that's fine. I can swap in and take multiple of those. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we do that. Hammer arm to sucker punch. Plus I have slack off, so I need to get health back. I can get health back. Um... You're just, I'm bringing you as extra support. If, if see if Toad Scroll say or Bombi wants to come in, I can go you. Or if, if I'm, if I don't care about sticky webs anymore and it's just, just for Bombi, I can go for you because you wall Rabombi really well. You handle Rabombi so well, it's not even funny. So that's easy. I think we have a good team. Um, getting rid of, getting rid of sticky webs is going to be very, very important for us. So that's what I have to prioritize is getting rid of sticky webs. Which is why I'm bringing you, because you can handle my Lodic pretty well. You are weak to U-turn, but it's not a physical attacker. Which is why it's not doing that much damage. And I'm going to go plus defense, so I get even more support on my side. And I have a, I have a Citrus Berry, so I can, I can eat at least three of those. I can eat at least three of them. Rapidson's going to help. I mean, Mega Drain, Mud Shot, I can get my health back if I need to. I'm going to get a plus one. To my, but Download's going to give me plus special attack. You come in and wall. Both align with Head Smash. 
You just immediately go. You should immediately go for the hammer arm as he swaps in because no one wants to take hammer arm. No one wants to take a hammer arm, especially Rampardos. Um, if because if, if Rabombi goes sticky webs and then U turns, I can. And Rabombi wants to come back in. I just bring you back in. I can bring you right back in on sticky webs and go rapid spin very next turn. It's not a big deal. You handle Claw and and Magmortar. You're back up for Magmortar because you outspeed Claw. So if they're males. Then I can just mollywop them because I can captivate them. I'm faster than Claw. Claw's no problem at all. I have recover. They don't, even Thunderbolt's not doing half damage to me. Thunderbolt does like 44 max, like 45% max. So I can take one. I can take two of those. It's going to be scary, but I can take two of them and then go for captivate and lower his special attack and then swap to Dracovish, for example, and then go that. You do really good things against Rampardos. And you do good things against most things. I mean, Aura Sphere is kind of scary, but you do have really good special defense. Um, you're mainly for a Bombi. If I need to pivot into like a like another head smash, I can go to you. And on the Earthquake, I can go to you. You know, I can also do that. It's not that worrisome. It's not that worrisome. I think we're good. I think this is a good team. My Lodex is actually pretty good. My Lodex is actually really good. So let's change the overlay. Let's go back and let's fight this first little mini boss we have to deal with. Um, Kutra's on the team, Swalot's not on the team, it is slacking. Slacking! Um, so Ledge is not here, it is Milotic. Oops, sorry. Milotic! Dracovish is actually here. Rodham is not here, it is Ferrothorn. And then it is not Overquill, it is indeed Toad School. Okay, let's get it. This is the team, let's fucking get it. That's a decent team, honestly. I like this team. I like I have good idea. I like I like the way I can I have rapid spin, which is gonna help me because I don't want sticky webs up. I don't want sticky webs up. I do not want to be slowed down. If I'm slowed down, that kind of ruins my thing with you. Not ruins it, but it just makes it to where you're not faster than Bofalant after the first turn. You're not faster than Claw. So yeah, it's gonna I have to I have to make sure I get that up. Citrus berry, chillin' berry, citrus, 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 citrus. Okay. Defense, defense. Ooh. Special defense. Special plus my attack. No, yeah, because you have you can eat moves even better against them. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Your defense against Rampardos and your defense because you're backup and your defense actually you're special. You are special, you're modest. That you can KO, that you can do over half damage. That you for sure two shot mag mortar. You for sure two shot mag mortar. That's what that does. Okay. Okay, here we go. Woo! I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's let this motherfucker's ass, yeah? Uh, say better open up for me. You better open that shit up. I definitely have flash. My Lodic looks sick. Let me tell you that. My Lodic's actually really good. It has a lot of good stats. Oh, I gotta fight you. I should have went all the way around. What am I doing? Um, we just go Mega Drain. No one's gonna eat these. No one's gonna eat these. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Freaked out for no reason, you know? Go this way. I didn't fight you. Okay, here's here. I gotta fight everybody now. Attack Rose. Oh shit. Let's just get you out here actually. Oh, that doesn't even do that much damage to you. I probably should have fucking. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Whoo! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, he's got Dragon Breath. We eat that. We eat that. It's almost like a preview for Surge. Honestly, holy shit. Woo! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let me save real quick so at least we know where we're at. See how far we are. Hope the Dookies are having a good one. And let's get into it. I'm ready, man. I am so ready. 
I go and go around that guy. Can't go that way. I have to fight this person. Yes, I have to fight you. Mm, dust talks. Let me go much shot. Okay, that's actually fine. Um, we just go metal claw. Metal claw. Cool, cool, cool. Um, Armaldo, 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 Armaldo. Metal claw. Metal claw. Beautiful. My attack just rose. Holy shit, power to do so much. We'll fight you. Initial attack rose. We go mud shot all day. Giraffe, we go mud shot all day. Spikes, huh? Didn't come swap any idea. Not a chance, my guy. Fuck, I probably should stop doing that. Oh, I can't even fucking hit this guy. I'm gonna use this. I'm um, gonna go Rock Tomb. Rock Tomb. Beautiful. The Crosma, huh? It's dead. Let's go. Granados, Slash Cannon just takes you out, my guy. Whoo! Okay. We go around. We go right here. Down right here. Beautiful. Okay, okay, okay. What's this? Iron Tail. Ooh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Here's the battle, here's the battle. Okay. Everyone's good, everyone's good, everyone's good, right? Yep, yep, yep. There we go, we're gonna save it. There we go, let's get into it. I'm ready for this battle. I'm ready. Let's do it. It's a rapid spinning motherfucker. I mean the, uh, sticky web. Let's do it, shall we, Dookies? Mm-hmm. We go rapid spin all day. It's faster than me all day. Wow. It actually doesn't even go. Wow. It actually doesn't even go for the sticky web. Because it sees that I have that. It actually is crazy. There it is. That's fine. Rapid spin now. And then I go for Abbott's one more time. Oh, just in case it went for it on the... Yes, just in case it goes for it right there. Okay, both Lant comes out. We do our plan. Yep, that's our plan all day. We go hammer him all day. Sucker Punch. He's dead. Beautiful. Yep, because Hammer Arm made me slower than him. So now Claw's a law. We go to you all day. We eat that. We go Captivate. Wow. Um, I go recover. I go captivate. Oh, he's female! That's okay. That's okay, that's okay, that's okay. I did not notice that. I definitely would have saved my fucking dude. We go, uh, water gun. No flinch. Come on. Dracovish, you're better than this. I know you are. We're fucked. We're so fucked. Oh, we're so fucked. I have to go for it. I have to go for it. I have to. Whoo! We live on one. It doesn't kill him. But now it's a random move, and I have to bring you out here. Oh, it's so scary. Actually, I probably can bring you out here. Let's bring you. That's actually... Oh my fucking gosh. I have to calc now. Holy shit. Hold on a second here. I knew this thing was going to be a problem. I knew this thing was going to be a problem. Everyone's done this job so far, except for... You're for... I have to save. I cannot bring... Oh, no. This might not end good for me. Oh, no. Mag Mortar. I gotta calc it. I gotta calc it. Mag Mortar against Gudra. Can Gudra come in here and actually do something to this gang? What is Gudra right now? Gudra's plus... 
Defense? Is that what Gudra is right now? Ah, oh, I should have made you plus. I should have swapped that around. Um, I have a citrus on me, right? I already popped my citrus, so my citrus is actually gone. Um. Oh man, I have seventy-five percent on me. I have seventy-five health on me. Okay, how much do I have? How much do I have? I should be able to stay in and go for Rock Tomb here and kill this thing. I honestly should be able to. Rock Tomb does about 50%. It does 49 at least. I have Fatal Precision. Aura Sphere does not take me out. Aura Sphere, yeah, because the Flamethrower does 40%. Now he got a crit. He got a crit with that. There's no way. I'm staying in. I'm staying in. I'm going to go for the Rock Tomb. I have to save this thing for Claw. I have to. I'm faster than Claw. I can. I think I do it. I do it. I have to risk it for Biscuits here, and we do it. It's going to take it out. It's going to take it out. Yes, I knew it. Let's go. Okay. That's fine. Now I can go back to you. Bury. Captivate. Recover. Captivate. Side shock. Captivate. Recover. Side shock. Side shock. Side shock. Water pulse. It doesn't kill me. It doesn't kill me. It does 44%. It does 44%. We're fine. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Okay. It says last Mon left. We have to go Ferrothorn here. Okay. Power Whip all day kills this thing. Let's get it. Let's get it! Come on! Hit this shit! Come on! Oh! Oh! Oh no! Oh no, no, no! I almost gave him a fucking wide lens, too. I almost gave you wide lens. Let me double check. Let me double check it. I almost gave him wide lens, man. I almost gave him wide lens. Which would have made for sure it hit. Because it would have, the accuracy would have went to 99%. Fuck. I almost gave it to you, my guy. I almost gave it to you, too. Head smash is going to do only 43%. We're fine. We can eat this again. We're fine. We're fine. We can eat this. We can eat this. We have to go for it. We have to go for it. We have to. Oh, quick draw, motherfucker! <laughs> Let's go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Oh, man. Quick draw for the fucking dub. And you survived on one, bro. Uh, you getting fucking... I'm surprised he didn't swap on Claw like he did it, like, like he did the first time to Mag Mortar. That's insane, actually. We fucking do it. Let's go. Oh, I'm fucking hyped. Let's fucking go. Oh, we actually need to escape, actually. Let's go ahead and, uh... Let's get out of here. We're here. But now we have to... Um, we have to leave. We have to go prep for the next battle. So we have to go back to that fucking, uh, Poke Center over here. Okay. No worries. No bad. Let's go. We fucking made it through. Let's fucking go. I'm hyped! Alright, who's the next one? Who is the next one? Oh, shit. Too far. Too far. Too far. Too far. There we go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's going on? Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go, right there. Okay, it's this one. It is this one. It's only four guys, double battle. Um, what time is it? We get a little more time, right? Yeah, we got like an hour. Got like an hour and change. Like an hour and change. I should be able to beat this guy, get one encounter, and maybe go fight the next guys, get another encounter. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. I don't gas no brakes, huh? This guy says to me. Okay, here we go. Um, So I'm thinking. Let me look real quick. I was thinking uh, Incineroar. And Sinner will actually be able to wall both the uh, fire and grass moves. I have fake out so I can fake somebody out. And then I bring Cerulege to take somebody else out. That's what I'm thinking. Let me go ahead and uh, take some stuff from you guys real quick. Fuck it. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see what we got going on here. Let's go and put somebody away. Put you. We can be on the team for now. It's only four guys, so I can bring some backup. So I was thinking Incineroar, because Incineroar has fake out. 
I, they can't stop a fake out. I can fake somebody out and take that and take that same person out. So I'm gonna go you. Where's Sever Ledge at? Right there. Bring Sever Ledge because Sever Ledge can eat, also eat the fucking grass and the fighting and the fire moves, and he can take out um, Butcher Bell. There's no way. And then I can bring Gudra. Gudra's already on the team. Oh, Gudra's right there. Bring Gudra for Cherum. We wall that completely. Sylveon's a little scary. Um, I might bring you for Sylveon. And then I can bring backup. So who can handle grass, fire, and fairy? Grass, fire, and fairy. Who can handle all three of those? Not one single thing, huh? Embor's not bad in case I have nine tails and Cherim out there. I can swap to that, and you can actually do some decent damage to them. Because you actually are pretty good. And Cinnamore is going to be so good in this fight. Let me double check this. And Cinnamore is going to be so good. Let me tell you. Okay, so Incineroar is going to fake out Victory Bell. Because that's what I want to do. Victory Bell is the scariest thing on the, t on the field. Uh, 35, Incineroar. Incin. We go Incin. Incin is going to go what? Um, Oh, fake out plus fire punch just kills it. Like, that's easy. That's easy dubs. It does, it's, yeah, I fake this thing out all day because there's sun. There's going to be such right there's sun. So my fire punches are going to do so much damage. So yeah, 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 okay. So fake out this thing. Because I fake it out, boom, it can't do anything, 13%. And then it's going to attack me for 50%. And then I kill it right there. Um, nine tails. I have a berry on me. I have a berry on me, so, but they can't do too much. Yeah, Scorching Sands doesn't even do 30% to me. So that's actually a really good play in Sarah Ledge. Let's check out Sarah Ledge. Sarah Ledge at level 36. We can go plus um, special minus attack, actually. We don't need Culver Bear. We can go Citrus Berry in the sun. Um, yeah, you don't do much to me at all. You do the same thing. You do, you do about 30% to me. A Victory Bell. So Victory Bell is level 35 in the sun. Oh, yeah. Fake Out, fake out plus Flame Wheel. Easily KO is Victory Bell. So Victory Bell is now gone. So then it brings, so that means they have to bring out Cherum. Or... Sylveon. Because Ninetales is not a threat. I'm going to leave Ninetales there. Against these two, Ninetales is not a threat, like at all. Like, Ninetales is fine. I don't mind taking 30% each time. I mean, well, of course, Victory Bell is going to get gonna pop off with its move. Victory Bell is going to pop off. Um, Victory, yeah, Victory Bell's gonna hit me. Gonna hit me or Sarah Ledge. But it hits Sarah Ledge for less, so it's probably gonna go for Incineroar. It probably, Victory Bell's probably, actually, that's right. That's right, Victory Bell's not gonna do shit, because it gets faked out. It gets faked out, and then I'm gonna go for a Fire, or Flame Wheel onto it, and it's dead. So then I'm only taking damage from Ninetales onto one of these guys, which is fucking amazing. That is actually perfect. Plus special, minus... Special, yes. And same thing with you. Plus special, minus special. Because the fucking, the drought being up is going to help us out so much. And if I keep nine tails there, the nine tails will be in the night that's possible. So we keep you two, for sure. That's why I want to bring you. Because, well, it depends. Because if it's fucking, if I can kill Victory Bell, boom, first turn, right? Who are they going to bring in? Are they going to bring in Cherim? Are they going to bring in Cherim? Because Cherim's going to be level 36. It's going to get a big buff because it's fucking, you know, got all this big shit. So it's going to do, it actually does decent damage. But I can kill it still first turn. I can kill it in one hit. Like, I take the hit really well. And fucking Ninetales only does fucking, what is that? Fucking, yeah, Ninetales is only doing 30% to us. So both of us can take out. Cherum in the very next turn, which allows me, which, which allows either Incineroar or Sarah Ledge to go for Nine Tails and take it out and, and chip it down, because both of both Incineroar and and uh, Sarah Ledge can KO. Oh yeah, it's not even in doubles either, but it's okay. Doubles doesn't affect me. Um, it affects some of their moves. It allows uh, both of these guys can can two shot Nine Tails, so that's fine. Um, I definitely bring you in the background because you're super fucking good. You just have so much fucking HP that doesn't even, doesn't even, like, there's no way, like, Sylveon's probably the biggest threat because it has fucking, um, this fairy, this misty, this misty explosion, which is pretty scary. 
but we eat that pretty well actually um what about cereal edge level 36 plus special minus special why didn't i save this we actually eat that better than fucking Incineroar. Oh, so their special defense is so much better, though. Yeah. So their special defense is so much better, though. So, yeah, it's actually, you're actually really good for, I mean, you're actually good for that. What about slacking? Can slacking handle this? Oh, no. Slacking does not like that at all. What about Gudra? Gudra can eat it. Gudra doesn't like it. Gudra doesn't like it, but Gudra can eat it. So that's fine, because if, if it does that, it's, it's going to kill itself, and then it's fine. Um, that's actually, that's, that's me. We'll go with that. 36 plus special minus attack. Yeah, Psy Shock is its biggest thing. So if I bring you out, it's going to go for Psy Shock, which is fine. Because I can bring, do I have a Psychic Berry? I can probably give you a Psychic Berry. Do I have Psychic Berries? I do. It's a pay up a berry. Oh yeah, then definitely wants to go for Mystic Explosion. Mm. I probably still just go Citrus on you because we do we wall this team. We actually do wall this team pretty nice. I might just go Citrus on you, but just just because Citrus plus special. Plus special minus attack. We're gonna go plus special minus. That's kind of scary, but plus special minus speed. Plus special minus special. Okay. Give me citrus. No, I don't want to. I don't want to have you come in. So I, I, might, I might bring you in early before Sylveon comes in. So if I kill Victory Bell and it's and, and it's Cherum, I might switch to you just because I can swap out to you and save. I can whoever has more damage. I can swap out of that and save one of these guys. Like, maybe save you, or like I said, whoever has more damage on them, I'll probably swap out and go to you against Cherum and Ninetales, because you can wall that. You wall that really nicely. And I don't want you in against Sylveon. Against Sylveon, I would want you and you, honestly. I would want this and this against Sylveon. Because Sylveon might go for, for, might go for fucking Misty Explosion, which is fucking crazy. So I don't want... That's just crazy damage. I don't want anybody taking that that can't handle it. Plus extra damage. Like, you, you can take it plus an extra hit. You can take it plus an extra hit. So just in case they double into one of those slots, I can still take it. Um, fake out pressure is going to be so nice so nice for us, actually. So victory, like I said, victory bell dies first turn. Fake out plus flame wheel just takes it out. And then nine tails is going to do 30% max to either one of these guys. And then Cherim comes in. I swap to you. Whoever took the damage, I'm going to swap out. Go to bring you in. And then whoever's still here is going to take out Cherim. And then it's Cherim, and then Cherim's gone, and then it's Ninetales and Sylveon. And then I swap out of you and go to you on the Misty Explosion, or Hyper Voice, and I go to you, because you can resist that as well. It just depends, it honestly just depends. We have, this is a good team, honestly, it's a really good team, I like it. I like it, I like it, I can swap out if I need to. Fake Out Pressure is going to be so nice first, because I'm going to take out one Mon right away, which is insane in the membrane. My Lodex not coming, it is... Incineroar. Incineroar! Dracovish is not coming. It is Serral Edge. Um, Ferrothorn's not here. It is Embor. Um, Swalot. Embor has a lot of HP. That's why I'm bringing Embor. Embor, Embor resists the fire and he resists the grass. So that's why I'm bringing him. He's really good. He, did, he only is weak to the fairy. And the ground, of course. But ground isn't going to do too... If ground only does 30% to these guys, it's not going to do too much to you. Because I, you're really, you have so much HP. It's insane. So... Yeah, we go plus special defense. Reduces HP if it's hot. That actually is true. That's not very good. But... 
So I have a berry on you. Because you're not bad, but the Misty Explosion is so scary that I have to for sure bring you two for the Misty Explosion. And Embor just walls. Embor walls a lot of things. He has so much HP, I feel like he's going to be really good. He has a lot of HP. Which helps out. I feel like it's good. I feel like it's good. I feel like it's a good team. I really do. Like I said, fake out on the victory bell, take it out with the next turn right here, and then we, we take one hit. Depending on who swaps in is who I'm going to determine what happens next. Slacking may not be the best thing to come, honestly, just because slacking's not that bulky. Um, slacking could also come in against Cherim as well, honestly. But no, honestly, slacking, slacking has a lot of HP, though, too. Slacking's like Envor, he has a lot of HP. So he's going to take a hit. He's going to be able to take a hit, you know? I'm going to be able to take a hit with that thing. Um, Ferrothorn's not a good idea because he's weak to fire times four. So I can't have you come in. You just you just don't eat the Misty Explosion, honestly. You're really good, but you don't eat the Misty Explosion. Like, you really don't. Misty Explosion is so scary. And you also don't eat the Shuka. I mean, the Earthquake, or the, the Scorching Sands from Ninetales. I think it's a good team. Honestly, I think we have a good team. I'm not going to second guess myself here. These two are bulk. These two are bulk right here. If I need extra bulk... And these two are for uh, the Misty Explosion. And you just, you, you fake out pressure, can take one person out, leaving three of them left. And then we can take Cherim out next turn if I really need to, which leaving two left. So it's not that bad. If it's just Nine Tails and, and if it's Nine Tails and Sylveon, then these two just come in and these two just Mollywop. Like, literally, these two just Mollywop right here. These two can Mollywop, I was telling you. This thing takes out, these two combined can take out fucking. Sylveon, and I can swap back to you to take out fucking like, nine tails. Like, it ain't that big a deal. Okay. Honestly, I think it's really good. I think it's really good. Let's do it. Let's get into it. That's the thing. I think that's the best thing we can do. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. Well, if I should be trying to charge my phone right now, but no worries. Okay. All right. Let's do it. I'm ready to go. I think this is a team. Double check. Special, 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 special. Okay. Citrus, 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 citrus. Okay. I'm gonna do it. I believe. I honestly believe. Doing citrus so I can eat multiple hits. If I really need to eat multiple hits, which allow because I said victory bell is scary. Victory bell is gonna die first turn, which is super fucking clutch. Super clutch, super clutch. Which is really what I want. I need that for sure. I need that. Oh, come on. Just make this easy on me, my guy. Really? You have fucking Shadow Ball on you, bitch ass? Why? Woo! Okay, let's go. Okay. So we're one of the few fucking dudes we gotta fight, actually. Because I fought most of these motherfuckers already. Not you guys. I'm going around you, chumps. Let's go. Okay, I can go around you. I already fought you. Okay, here we go. Right here. We're already here. Let's go. Oh! I'm scary, bro. Okay, cool, cool, cool. It's him right here. It's him. It's this guy right here. Okay, here we go. Double battle are always scary because you just, I just don't know who they're going to go into, which is why I'm bringing Citrus Berries. Because I, if, in case I need to take two hits, I can take two hits. So we have the answer. Fake out pressure is going to help us a lot. Let's do it. Honestly, I believe. I believe in my team. I do believe in my team. I really do. This is no, there is, there is no Serena. There is no Queen is, Queen is Queen Majesty right now. So I'm totally fine. I go for Flame Wheel onto you. And Fake Out onto you. <coughs> You're now gone. We eat that easily. Easy, 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 easy. You should be dead. Beautiful. Worked out perfectly. Who comes in? Who is it? Cherim? It's Cherim. Okay. So, let me double check real quick. I know what Nine Tails does to my guys. Nine Tails can do about thirty percent to both. So let me check Cherim. Let me double check Cherim real quick. Cherim. Let's do Severed Edge. 
Um, Silver Ledge takes like nothing actually. Solar Blade does this in the sun. Hold on, in the sun. Hold on, hold on, in the sun. Silver Ledge takes over half damage, which is fine. I can probably keep you in. I can probably keep you in and kill you right now. I can kill you 100% right now. Um, what do you do to Incineroar? What do you do to Incineroar? Incineroar, you do about the you don't you don't do as much to Incineroar. So you probably bow. You probably go for Silver Ledge to try to take me out. Honestly. You probably go for Sever Ledge to try to take me out. Because you do the most damage to Sever Ledge. And Incineroar can eat another eat Incineroar can eat two hits. Incineroar it, it does forty four percent to me to fifty two with, with Silver Blade. That's nothing. Like we're fine. I, I literally KO both these things. I'm gonna go dark. I think I could I could stay in here. I'm just trying to think. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. I could probably I could possibly stay in because. I mean, we're not that, like I said, I'm not that worried because it does 60, it does, if Cherim goes for Cerulead, it's going to pop my berry 100% of the time, which means I easily can take another hit and KO Cherim, which means I can bring you two in against the Missing Explosion and the next thing. So I might do that. I might go and take you out. I could swap, I guess I probably could swap to you and just go this thing, honestly. I probably could just go this. That's probably what I do. Let me check Embor. Let me see how Embor eats these moves real quick. How does Embor eat this? Embor is plus special, minus special in the sun. Not very well, actually. What about Nine Tails? Psystock is the best thing it can do to me. So yeah, we definitely gonna go this thing. I'm gonna go this just because I can. I can sleep the moves. I'm, I'm gonna take Cherim out no matter what. And I can save Incineroar and get some fake out pressure in. Let's do it. Two. That's fine. Okay, berry pops. Totally fine. Berry pops. Easy peasy. So yes, it doubled into it doubled into Incineroar. That's totally fine, because now you're just gone. Yep. Okay. That's totally fine. Okay, now we keep you in 100 percent of the time. I'm gonna keep you in, and I go for Shadow Claw into you, and I immediately swap to you, and I go to this thing right here. I go swallow. It's okay. It's okay. This is me a two at KO. Beautiful. Yep, that's fucking amazing. We eat this. We eat this. Yep, we eat that. Wow, that's fucking beautiful. Let's fucking go. I forgot it hits his own side. I forgot it hits everybody. Let's fucking go. Woo! I'm hyped. I forgot Misty Explosion hits the whole field. Perfect. Perfect swap. Honestly, perfect swaps. I like it. I like it. I like it. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Now we get one encounter. We for sure get one encounter right now. It's Route 8. And then it's another double battle, which is fucking scary, but because the double battles are no fucking joke. These battles are no joke. I might not be able to be on too much longer. Like another hour, maybe max. Like max another hour. And that's like it, honestly. So let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and just take care of this many bots. Little this guy here, it's nobody. It's just nobody. I got I have to fight you though. Oh my gosh, who the fuck is this? Oh my god, good thing I fucking swapped my guy. That was insane. Whoo! Whoo! Scatterbug! You fucking cheeky motherfucker. You cheeky motherfucker. Ah, it's okay, we're fine. Alright, here we go. Route 8. Who's our encounter gonna be, huh? We need something clutch. Okay, hold on a second here. Let me pull up this next team. This next team's pretty fucking pretty good. Armoru Serena. Hisuian Arcanine, Basket Legion, and Hisuian Braviary. That is actually a really good team. That's actually a really good team. Zapidos. Zapidos. Oh, I might go Zapdos. I don't have an electric type. I do, but I don't have actually a flying type either. Oh, hold on a second here. Interesting. I might go one of you. Interesting. Araquanin. Araquanin is actually really good. Um, Araquanin actually is really good to start this fight out. If I go for Araquanid, um, Araquanid is actually really good because here's the team we're prepping for now. I'll go ahead and do this now before it gets encountered and just show you guys the team. It's this team right here. So this team's pretty damn fucking good. Like, I'm not going to lie. And so if. 
I were to go Serena at level 35. I can't fake out. I can't fake out due to the dude, the majesty, and go Raquinade. Let's just go custom set, and let's just go 36. 36. Um, Power Up Tilt does a fuck ton to me. Power Up does a lot to me. Oh my god. I was thinking of going maybe Toad Scroll. Because Toad Scroll can eat the. I mean, it eats, it doesn't eat the power, but it might go for knockoff. It probably goes for knockoff. And I want to go with this because if I go for this, I go modest. And I go soft sand. I can KO Armor Rouge. Armor Rouge, let's go with 35. Because I'm, I'm going to get a plus. That's right. I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to get a plus my special attack. So yes, I'm going to get a boost to my special attack because of my download. And Armor Rouge's special defense is not as good. So I'm going to get a plus. I can always KO Armor Rouge first turn. Even without without Soft Sand. If, so in case I get knocked off, I still have an 87% chance to KO Armor Rouge first turn. Which is still really fucking good. Um, I would say maybe Gliscor. I don't think Gliscor can, I don't, I don't think Gliscor can take out this thing in one hit. Um, let's check out Glyce. Because I'm faster than Armor Rouge. So that's why. Armor Rouge would definitely hit me. I mean, would die without me doing anything. Um, if I go Adamant. 68% chance to KO. Huh. I guess the scary thing, if I don't KO, if I don't KO the Armor Rouge, it's over. Armor Rouge is so scary that if I have to, I have to KO, which is why I think Serena is going to see that I KO it and go for a knockoff. I feel like onto my, my, my Toad Scroll because it, it would see that I can't kill it without, it, it would see that there's a chance I can't kill it with, without my Soft Sand. So it might just try to knock off my Soft Sand. So I can't, there's a, there's a slight chance I don't KO it. And Gliscor, dude, it's, I don't know, 70% chance. That's a, that's not, I don't know if that's, I don't know if that's the worst gift for the biscuits, you know? Um, Serena's pretty fucking strong. That's all there is to it, like. Serena's really fucking strong. I don't even think, in Sin, let's see, let's see if Embor can take this thing out. Embor, can Embor take this thing out? Um, with Fire Punch? Fire Punch doesn't even take this thing out. If I went Charcoal. That same thing. It's a 81%, but it's like Armor Rouge is going to fuck me up. Oh no, it won't. It has stored power. Oh, but then it'll fuck me up if it gets a we if it gets its weakness policy off, it'll definitely fuck me up. Oh no. That's the thing, this thing's scary, because I want to kill Armors in one turn, so I don't have to deal with it anymore. And Toad Scroll can almost do that. Like, it's it's guaranteed unless I get knocked off. Even if I get knocked off, it's an 88% chance to do it. Like, that's in, that's, that's insane. I'm Dude, I might have to do that. It's just, because if I get knocked off, it's going to suck so bad, though. Uh, because... I need someone that can come in there, because you eat the grass move. I need someone that can come in there and eat the grass move and take him out. And you don't probably do it. Gliscor is not a bad option, but even with fucking... I might go Zapdos. I'm thinking Zapdos. Let me, let me look up Zapdos real quick. So I might go Zapdos and try to try to, try to to go for Zapdos. Because Zapdos might be a good play for this. Because I don't have... I only have one electric type, and it's the Rodoms. I only have one flying type, and it's Gliscor. So I feel like Zapdos is pretty damn good. Uh, let me double check Zapdos real quick. Let me see what Zapdos got working with. Zapdos is right here. I might go for Zapdos. Zapdos has really good special attack. 125. 100 base speed. Um, I get fucking Bolt Beak. I get fucking Pluck right away. I get I get Bolt Beak right. I get Bolt Beak right away, which is fucking insane, actually. Oh, that's right. Bolt Beak doesn't do help. It doesn't help me at all, though. Do I can you learn Aerial Ace? You do learn Aerial Ace, but is Aerial Ace even enough? You're a special attacker, that's right. Oh, what special attacking flying move do you even get then? Do you even get a special attacking flying move? Air Slash, my fucking tutor, you're a motherfucker. 
Yeah, no, it might not be that. Um, dude, damn, that's kind of crazy, actually. It's definitely not that. That thing doesn't have enough, but it has. That thing doesn't have what I need. Um, that's just, just this, this battle's scary. This battle's so scary. Just because it's just how much is, how, what's, how, what's at stake. What's at stake right now, man? If we beat this battle, we unlock hidden abilities, and we get a lot more encounters, and a lot more good things come to us. Toad's Rule is a really good answer for armor readers. Oh, because, or I could check Incineroar. Let me check Incineroar with Darkest Lariat. Because Incineroar with Darkest Lariat might be able to take it out. Might be able to. No, it's more defensive. It's more defensive. So I have to, you want to try to hit on the special side? You want to try to hit, yeah, you want to try to hit it on the special side. That's for 100% sure. Yeah, even with black glasses, bro, that's not going to do it. No, yeah, no, 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 it doesn't do it, it doesn't do it, it doesn't do it at all. Plus, he has Aura Sphere. The closest thing I can probably get to is honestly going to be fucking... Ugh, because there's Wu Qian, there is Wu Qian. Wu Qian's so slow, though, isn't it? Is Wu Qian faster than this thing? Would Wu Qian be faster than this thing? No, because Wu Qian, yeah, no, this thing's faster than me. This thing is definitely faster than me. Uh, because, yeah, I could even go plus, I'm going plus speed. Yeah, no, I don't do enough. I don't do enough of this thing. Okay. I'll make to that. This thing's honestly the best bet, because this thing, it's just, you want to hit it on the special side, and I have no, I have no ground types right now. Besides that and that. I know I have an encounter to get. I'm just slacking with getting my encounter right now. Um... I mean, Bystar is right there. King Gambit is not bad. I do have another Steel type, though. Let me check the time again. And when do we have you? Tapu Lele. Tapu Finny, sorry. Draco Zolt. Draco Zolt's not bad, but. Uh, I'm just thinking. I almost want to, like, prep for this battle first and then get this encounter. Because Slacking has Water Absorb, which could be good for Basket Legion. But my special attack is abysmal. So. Braviary would would absolutely wreck me. Um, I have to see how much damage. Cause Basque Legion, I mean, like, yeah, Slacking does really good against Basque Legion because he's fucking. I have what's it called? I have Water Absorber, so he can't he can't do much. He can't do anything to me, and I'm normal type. Slacking, and Sucker Punch does about two shot him. It does two shot him. Um, what about RK9? RK9 does not kill me. I would go Citrus, probably. I would probably go Citrus Berry. It's like a muscle band. Nah, I go Citrus. You go Citrus with Slack Off. And I can come in against... So I can come in against Arcanite and um, when Basculine's on the field. Because my special defense is abysmal. So I can't come in... Braviary probably just wrecks me. I probably cannot come in against Braviary. Like, it's probably way too strong to come in against... It's probably way too strong. Yeah, Sucker Punch doesn't do as much. Yeah, it, it's it think it's this thing's too strong for me. It's it's this thing's strong. But I, I want to come in primarily against Basque Legion and something else. Or what do I do? Is mm, I can't though. I can't prioritize the Serena. I can't like leave Armrus. I can't leave Armrus out there and prioritize Serena. I'm just thinking. Can I try to do that? Can I try to take out Serena first? And get rid of. Can he? Can, can this thing do it? Can I get rid of Serena first and just leave Arm Rouge out there? Is that possible? Because if I just leave Arm Rouge out there, then he's not really doing too much to me, you know? Like, he didn't really do too much to Toad Scroll. Um, I'm just trying to think. I'm just trying to think. 35 against. Let's go. Let's go. Heat. Heat. Heat bottom. Oh wow, I do just KO you. I actually do just fucking straight up just KO you. Like, straight up overheat just goes, fuck it, you're dead. Like, literally, you're done for. Like, I could probably do that. I could probably do start with this thing. This thing, Molly Glops. Um, what about Armor Rouge? Armor Rouge, Armor Rouge, Armor Rouge, Armor Rouge. Double check Armor Rouge's damage on me. Okay, I might have found out the play. I might have figured out a good play. I might just leave Serena out there. 
And then when I'm right here, here, here's, here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thinking. Okay, listen, 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 Linda. Let me do this real quick. Store you, store you, store you, store you, store you. Okay. Starting with you, and starting with you. Because what can happen is, I can go for the kill on onto Serena with Rodham. Okay, that's 100% happening. And then I don't take really much of anything from Armoru. It's 30%. That's not much at all. Why do I keep doing that? So I can KO this thing one hit. My special attack drops. I have Regenerator. I have Regenerator, so I'm not worried about that. Um, and then Toad Scroll. Oh, that's a scary thing, though. I'm spelling it wrong. I'm still spelling it wrong. Why am I spelling it wrong? R, M, A. Oh no. Okay. Armor Rouge. That's thirty-five. Ah, oh, I'm just thinking. I'm just thinking. I'm just thinking. Cause I might do is I might I might I might not start with you then. I definitely want to bring you take out Serena first turn. Hi, little guy. What's up? I uh, take out Serena first turn. Easy. Um, so you're gonna distract me, my guy. I love you so much, but I, I'm I'm on a, I'm on a time crisis, my guy. Um, Toad Scroll. I might not bring Toad Scroll because I might just leave Armorous there. I might just leave Armorous there and bring somebody else in who can, else can handle. Like, because I can bring somebody. I can, I, I, I can just attack Armorous. No, I don't want to hit him, though. I don't, I don't even want to hit him. Like, honestly, I wouldn't even want to fucking hit him. I guess you can come up here, Shadow. Come on up. Um, I can't pet you, though. You're, like, in the way, though, big guy. You're, like, you're a big guy, my guy. Okay. So you have to sit down if I want to be here, my guy. You got to sit down. Thank you. Thank you, my guy. I love you so much. I love you so much. Like I said, I'm on a time crisis, my guy. I'm trying to beat this. I'm trying to beat this boss here. I ain't got no time to do the boss. I do the thing. I do the thing. I got no time. I got no time. Okay. Um, Because I don't want to KO Armor Roots. Because I don't want to not KO it and get, get fucking weakness policy off. And I just get fucking wrecked. I do not want that to happen. It's happened before. I do not want it to happen again. So I do not want to hit Armourouge. I'm going to leave Armourouge alone, or I'm going to just fucking tickle it and do nothing to it. I don't even want to do nothing to it because it's going to get fucking... It has fucking stupid-ass weak armor. So it's going to get, what, plus defense minus speed or plus speed minus defense? It's one of those two things. I forget what it is. Okay, Shadow, you motherfucker. God damn it. You're like on my headset. Okay, that's what I don't like, bro. You have to be here. You have to be mindful of where you're sitting, my guy. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Shadow. I need you to, like, lay down. You're, like, annoying almost because you're, like, in the way, my guy. I don't have much room where I'm sitting right now. No, I can't pet you right now, my guy. I'm so sorry. Okay. So, let me think. Let me think. Let me think. We're getting distracted. Sorry, I'm getting distracted here. Um, arm. It's, it's definitely Rodham. Rodham definitely comes in. KO Serena first turn. Easily. Easily as that. It's the easiest thing I've ever seen in my life. Um, free. It's basically free. And then you're going to take a hit. That's fine. You're going to take two hits. Two hits even. That's fine. You have Regenerator. I can swap out. And you have Regenerator. It's no big deal. I'll give you Citrus Berry. Here, here's what we do. Easy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab my encounter later. I don't really need my encounter. I don't need my encounter right now. I wanna. I don't need it right now. I'm gonna worry about getting my team set up for this motherfucker um, before time runs out. Quite honestly, so you guys can actually see a battle. And I can maybe hit, maybe hit fucking, uh, maybe hit, uh, you know, hit the abilities today. Like I've been fucking talking about for the past fucking week. It seems like. Um, I wanna go. Of that all day because I want to be able to bulky. I want to be able to eat. Actually, no, I don't want to do that. Actually, do I do that? Um, yeah, because I want to be able to eat the moves from fucking Armor Rouge in case I need to. Um, because you're really good for Serena. Easy, easy, easy. Give you a berry. Boom. Easy as that. Okay, here we go. I need to go get. Give me your berries, boys. Wait, what? Not the dingles. Ee, ee. Okay, cool. All right, so now let's see here. Who else? Like I'm saying, I don't want to risk not killing Armourouge. I think I just leave Armourouge there, and then who is he gonna bring in? Armourouge again? Who? Who is probably? If it's what's his name over there? Fucking Arcanine. With Arcanine against this, it would probably be Arcanine. It's either Arcanine or it's gonna be, um. Basket Legion. If it's Basket Legion, I immediately swapped Slacking. Like, Slacking is easily coming, because Slacking can wall the uh, Basket Legion pretty good. 
and I like that a lot, so I'm definitely gonna do that. I might, I can't go body slam, that's right, I can't go body, I have yawn though. Um, Gudra probably comes in, Gudra's really good against Brave Yari, like really good against Brave Yari, so I'm gonna definitely bring you. I just need to figure out who else I want to bring. I might still bring you. Um, I need somebody for RK9. Who can handle a fucking... Who can handle that? Ugh. Who can handle rock and fire? And fucking deal right back to him. Like, a water type would be fucking amazing. You have really good HP, but your defense is not all there. Um, you don't resist the rock, which is what I'm scared of. You don't resist the rock, which is like, that's kind of scary. Dude. You, re you do resist the flame. You do resist the flame. You do resist a lot of different things here, except once Serena's gone, you do resist it. You are pretty good because, um, you're pretty good against Arcanine. You're pretty good against Arm Rouge. Let me check out. Let me check out. Arcanine is so fucking scary, man. Arcanine is so scary. He's so strong. And so fast with Rockhead, man. It's like not even funny how fast this thing is. Yeah, he might just go this thing. And if he does that, I go Draco. Let's see how Draco Vish eats this. Um, wow, Water Gun does just one-shot you. And I'm not faster, though. Oh, what a pain. And he has a Focus Sash anyways. So it doesn't even matter. So I need someone who's really I need someone who's really especially def who's really bulky defensively. You're not bad, but you're not good, like I said. You have to be able to eat. I have to be mindful of who else is on the field. That's the thing. Which is why if I keep Arm Rouge out there... If I keep Armourouge out there, um, what do I do then? What can I do? <laughs> I can probably. What, what if I brought you out there, and baited a fucking power whip, and baited you to go for power whip on me? Because I have Captivate. I'm just saying, I have Captivate. It's like, I can also click Recover first turn. Because Rodham, like I said, Rodham handles, Rodham easily KOs Tarina. And then... It's a matter of who comes in next. Who is going to come in next to Molly up this thing, bro? Oh, it's so scary. Can I go plus speed on you, actually? Oh, it's a speed tie. Claw, do you eat something for your life? Claw, do you eat something in your life? Do you, have you ever eaten anything in your life? Claw, you're not fast enough. Claw's not fast enough for the life of him. I, 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 need, I, need, I, need, I need a fast water type to come in and take out that thing. And it's not you. You only have 70 speed, right? 75. Ugh, oh, it's not you. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. This battle is so hard. We easily have Rodham for Serena. And I, I think I want to leave you alone. But then, but then is Armourouge a guy or a girl? Is Armourouge a guy or a girl? Oh, it's neither. Oh, wait, no, because you're a guy. Maybe it's a girl then? I don't think it matters, honestly. I don't think it really, I don't think it really depends on, on the form. I'm just thinking, um, because my, can my Lodic eat? Can my Lodic eat? I would have to go Rindo Berry. I would have to go Rindo Berry to bait out the move. I eat those all day. Like I said, if he's male, I just go for Captivate. I go for Captivate, first turn, on the Armourou, so it lowers a special attack, and then I go for Overheat onto, on a Serena, and then they're they're both dealt with. They're both dealt with, because now Armourou is sitting there with at minus two, and then Serena's gone. So they has to bring somebody else in against both of these guys. This sets me up for Arcanai. So I can take Arcanai. I mean, Arcanai is fast as fuck, though. It's a speed tie. It's a speed tie between me and Arcanine. Isn't it? Isn't it a speed tie between me and Arcanine? Wasn't it a speed tie if I went at plus speed? Plus speed minus special, for example. And I went Arcanine. At level 35. 
It's a speed tie, so I might have to go speed tie that. I might have to do that. I might have to go plus speed so I can try to outspeed the Arcanine. I think I have to. I think I have to. Like, I start with you, and I think I start with you, because I can captivate Armor Rouge, which is really good. Lowering a special attack is really good. Um, Serena goes down first turn. Armor Rouge stays there, minus two, which allows me to dictate who come out. Not dictate, but it allows me to just take out one at a time, so I can figure out who I, so I can, so I can, so I can determine who I want to come in. If it's these two, I really feel like it's going to be, if I feel like, if I feel like it'll be Arcanine. I feel like it'll be Arcanine, it's going to force me to swap out of you and go to somebody who can eat the head smash. Who can eat the head smash? You don't eat the fire move. Holy shit. You're good for a head smash and not a fire move. I can't risk that. I cannot risk that. Holy shit. That's kind of scary. Rock is not... Uh, you don't eat the fire move. That's what's so scary. You guys don't eat... Both you guys don't eat the fire move. That's what's so scary. I mean, Gudra's right there, but the fire move is so scary. Okay, Gudra. Let's try Gudra against Arcanite. Gudra! If Gudra were to go plus defense, minus speed... With a citrus berry. Gudra can eat the head smash and eat that, but not do anything to him. I'm just thinking, if Gudra comes, say, I kill Serena, and it's Arm Rouge and Arcanine. I then would swap you out to you and take Arcanine out with you. I, I'm going to give you a Rindo Berry. I'm going to give you the Rindo Berry in case he wants to go power, power Whip. I can eat the Power Whip. Easily, no problem at all. Plus speed. Minus attack. Um, you're just going to go plus special defense. Because I'm going to swap you out. If I need to, I'll swap you out easy. Arm Rouge just sits there. Okay, you take out Arcanine turn two. If it's Arcanine, if it's Basque Legion in, if it's Basque Legion in Armor Rouge, I go this. If it's Basque Legion in Armor Rouge, I just leave these two guys in here. And we're fine. If it's Basque Legion in Braviari... I mean, if it's Armor Rouge and Bravey Arrow, I go Gudra all time. Every time. I swap out of you and I go Gudra. And I keep you in because you have really good special defense. And so you can take out, you can help me, you can captivate somebody. You help me really good against Bravey Arrow. You have Rock Tomb. Armor Rouge is not scary. If I can, if I can, if I can captivate Armor Rouge, he's not scary. Um, I also have Water Pulse, so it's not like it's just I have to, I, I have to dictate what I do. I have Recover as well. If it's Armor Rouge and Arcanine, I probably have to go you. If it's Armor Rouge and Braviary, I have to go you. If it's Armor Rouge and Basque and uh, Basque Legion, I have to go you. Which means I have to swap. I mean, swap out. I probably swap out of. Ooh, I probably would swap out of you and keep you out there. Depending on how much health you have, I would probably keep you out there. Because I don't. Yeah, I'm just thinking. I don't want to double KO them. I don't. I don't want to double KO them because it's gonna be hard to deal with whoever comes out next. So I can just keep one person out there, like Armor Rouge, and, and slow him down and make him to where he can't do much, then I'll be fine. Um, um, I don't think I bring you at all then. I'm going to leave you back there. You come in against Basque Legion. If it's Armor Rouge and Basque Legion, I don't, I don't want Armor Rouge leaving. I want to leave him there. So you take out you take out Serena first turn. You take out Citrus Berry. Let's go ahead and give you the Rindo Berry so you can eat the Grass move. If he wants to go for the Grass move on you, and then you go plus speed, minus attack. So that way, if Arcanine does come out next, you you might be able to outspeed Arcanine. If you don't outspeed Arcanine, it's over. I mean, not over, but you just you just die. Honestly, I mean, I'll, I'll take the death. That's how it's going to have to be. Um, we have plenty of water Pokemon. I mean, honestly, we have... Not plenty. We have a couple, but... Eh. Okay, okay. So now I need to bring some good backups here. Like, I need to bring good backups for Arcanine... Uh, I'm trying to think, man. Cursula's not a bad answer for Braviary as well. Swalot's right there. I can bring you, because you're not terrible. You can KO some things, and you do eat some moves relatively. Um, You can be a good backup for Arcanine as well. And I might bring... Oh, but you don't eat the water, but it's right. I would say you, because you can wall... Even with the, I guess, Ayachi Berry, that's right, because you have Flying, I can't, because I can't, I mean, you're good against Braviary or Basque Legion, but I have to decide which one, because Serena dies first turn, that's not a problem. Arm Rouge is you, all day. 
you are Braviary or Arcanine. You're for Basque Legion. And you are for... Uh, you don't eat the... I mean, you're so, you just don't eat the move from Arcanine. Arcanine is so dangerous. It just doesn't happen. Arcanine is so dangerous. What about Beware? Does Beware eat the move from Arcanine? Does Beware... But Beware probably doesn't eat the fucking... The, what's it called? He probably doesn't eat the fucking... He probably doesn't eat the... What's it called? You already know what I mean. Oh, wow. He actually does eat moves really well. Oh, wow! But where is actually really fucking good? But where doesn't have ice skills? But where has illuminate? Where has the best ability in the game? Illuminate. I have hammer arm. I do have hammer arm. Hammer arm can one shot, but I, it's ah, you're cheeky though because see, you have a focus sash. I, I would have to double into you, and I also have doll eyes, which is actually really clutch. I might bring you because you are really good. You do have a lot of HP. I don't know if I bring you though. I'm just thinking. I need backups. Serena. Armor Rouge, we have you for Braviary, we have you for Sla- I mean, for, for Brabascules, we have you for... Because you can't- you, if it's Basket Legion too, you can, you, don't, you eat the move- oh, it's Braviary. If it's can't be- you cannot come in against Braviary, though. It's Braviary and Arcanine, that's when I have to go, uh, you two. Uh, actually, shit. If it's, if it's Arcanine and Braviary, that's- we're in trouble, honestly. We're looking- we're in some deep shit. Because I can bring... Yeah, that's, that's where we're in deep shit. So that's what I'm saying. Armor Rouge has to be out there as long as I can keep Armor Rouge out there. Honestly. Armor Rouge has to be out there as long as it can. Hopefully it doesn't swap. That's what I'm hoping. I'm hoping it doesn't swap. If it does, I mean, that's fine. Honestly, if it does, that's totally fine. Because I can, I, I can work with that. Which means I can take... I'm not taking damage and I'm going to be doing damage to the other guy. It's just so scary. This battle is so scary because it has, it has a lot of answers for it. This battle has a lot of answers. Draco Vicious is my one thing. I don't know if I bring it. It's good against Armor Rouge. It's good against um, Arcanine, but it's okay against... I mean, it's actually really good. It's actually decent against... Let me see. Let me check it. Let me check it. Basque Legion. Basque Legion. Level 436 against Draco Vicious. We do eat those moves decently. Drake, 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 Drake can go. That. Citrus Berry, Dragon Breast is decent. What about Braviary? Oh, Braviary is so fucking strong, too. Holy shit, man. Braviary is strong as fuck. God damn. Bra. Brady. Ari. Okay. Um. I don't want to bring Dracovish. I really don't. Dracovish is one thing I'm like, I don't know if I want to bring Dracovish. I might see what my encounter can be. Um, honestly, we're getting close, we're getting close, we're getting close, we're getting close, we're getting close. No, trust me, we're getting close. Oh, uh, you're not bad. I do like you a lot. But would you help me out with your... You help me against... Uh, I'm going to pull up Draco's ult real quick. Could you do help me with... You have decent. You don't have good special defense, though. You do resist the water. You do resist the flying. Not the ghost. You don't get bolt beak until later. You don't get. Yeah, no, you don't really get that much, my guy. Hmm. Don't know who to go for here, huh? This is this is a big encounter. I mean, by sharp, of course, by sharp's right there. By sharp is really good. By sharp can help me both against um. Basque Legion and Braviary. Bisharp is really decent. Let me check Bisharp out. Bisharp just doesn't evolve for a minute. Level 50. He has really, he doesn't have good, oh, he doesn't have good special defense though. Oh. Oh. I can calc it. I can calc it. I can calc it. Let's just go Bisharp random set. 36. Whoo, heat wave blowing me mind, bro. Holy shit. That is not happening. Okay. Ah, uh, I just don't know. I feel, like, I feel like I need an encounter that can help me out with this fight. I feel like I need it. I don't know. I really don't know. Hmm. 
Zapdos, dude, Zapdos could be really clutch, honestly. Zapdos has, doesn't Zapdos get fucking Bolt Beak? Is that what he gets? Zapdos gets Bolt Beak, right? Good special attack. It gets Bolt Beak, which is really fucking good. Yeah, it gets Bolt Beak right away, which is, Bolt Beak is really good. So we go, say we go Zapdos here. Let's go Zapdos, just go blank set. Actually, let's go Zapdos. What do you have? You don't have Bolt Beak. Okay, classic. You don't have Bolt Beak either. Okay, classic. So we go 36. And I go Bolt Beak. Bolt Beak doesn't KO, but that's because I would go fucking... I would go Adamant then. Plug it. Adamant! Bolt Beak does really good against you. Oh, dude. It might be this thing. I'm going to go Zapdos. Honestly, I'm going to go Zapdos. I'm going to say Rescue for the Biscuits, and we're going to go Zapdos. Can't paralyze the thing, but I can bring ground types. I can because what, what is it going to have? What is Zapdos going to have? Let me double check Zapdos real quick see what it's going to have. Um, it could have Ancient Power, which is a bit of a bit. Plug, Detect, Charge, Thunder Wave, Bolt Beak. Yeah, I'm going to bring... I'm going to bring Gliscor, I think. I'm going to bring Gliscor. Okay, I'm going to try to get this. I'm going to try to get this encounter. I'm gonna bring, I'm gonna, I'm gonna catch Zapdos, and Zapdos is gonna be a clutch factor in this fight. I'm telling you. Zapdos is gonna be a clutch factor in this fight. I'm telling you. Zapdos is gonna be a clutch factor. Um, I bring you real quick. Bring you, because you can eat the moves really well. Um, he has flying, but not you. Okay. Let's go uh, you switch over here. I'm pretty sure it is day and night. Yes. Okay. Um, let me level my guy up real quick. I feel like this could be a good encounter for us. This is definitely this, this, this will be if I catch this, this will be the this will be the sixth mod I bring. Oh wow, you turn, you actually get U turn. Wow, it's actually really sick. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um, let's give you a citrus berry. Okay, let's do it. So that way I can not die to the, uh, just in case things go a little hasty. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's catch this. Yo, what's up? Was taken. Hope you're doing good. That's a long name. Sorry, man. Yeah, it's day. One thousand and twenty-two was taken. Oh shit, this guy's pretty fucking strong. Come on, just catch real quick. Oh, I was scared of that. I was definitely scared of that happening. Um, but I have Rusto, so it doesn't matter. Oh no. Oh no. Whew, okay, we're fine. Oh, I thought that was it, honestly. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. He can get the fucking boost, but I can't. Oh my goodness. We're fucked. Oh no. I'm gonna go you. I don't have any status. I can't, can't status him at all. You don't confuse, right? Let's go, you. Oh, that was scary. Oh, my fucking goodness. Get you back out here. Okay. Oh, my goodness, man. This guy is balling out right now. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to lose this counter, aren't I? I am. Oh my goodness, I'm not gonna be able to go for this encounter. I brought the wrong Pokemon, but where? What are you doing here? Oh my goodness, you got the fucking boost from the fucking goddamn fucking thing. Oh my goodness, I can't. That's insane. I can't get this encounter now. Because you got the fucking... Why would why would they allow the wild Pokemon to get the boost if I can't get the boost? That makes no... Honestly, that... I thought I thought I really thought ancient power boost was just was just you can't get it. Oh, 
That's so shitty, dude. That's why I'm gonna lose this encounter because of the ancient power. I'm, I, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't. Oh, I'm fucked, and I just died. I just lost my wear because I'm a fucking idiot. Oh my goodness. Oh, I fucking hate this. Wow. I'm fucked. I'm so, f dude. Oh, now I'm really mad. Now I'm really, now I'm like, I'm furious right now. Because Beware is going to be so fucking clutch for us. Oh my god. Dude, fuck this game. Why is that? Why, 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 why can, why, why can you get the boost on ancient power? I hate that. That's so stupid. That's the worst mechanic I've seen since ages ago. Oh, and I have to bring Dracovish. Well, that's another death to the fucking... Wow, you gotta be kidding me. That's really how that just happened? I just lost somebody like that? Oh! And I'm on a time crunch, too. I'm trying to, like, fucking get this shit done so I can, like... Before I... Uh, I'm trying to show you guys, like, the fucking hidden abilities and shit before I leave today. Because I'm, I'm not gonna... I'm only gonna be on for, like, another 20 minutes. So I have to get in this battle, like, right now. Like, I have to... Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. I mean, we have good Pokemon. It's just, like... But where was gonna be so clutch against the motherfucking Arcanine? Why? Why can they get the boost? I don't like that. I don't like how the wild Pokemon can get the boost. Fuck off. That's so dumb, dude. It should just... Ugh. It just blocks it for your Pokemon. It blocks it for your Pokemon and that's it. I just... I understand. I understand it. I get it. I understand. I just think it's dumb because that's literally why I lost that encounter. I shouldn't have gone for Zapdos. I should have gone for somebody else. God... Why me? Why me? Why do I why do I do these things? I have to figure out what to do now. I have to swap my I have to pivot. I have to pivot. Oh my goodness. I'm so mad now. Who else did I have on the team? Why did I get rid of Who else did I have on my team? Who else was I gonna bring? It was Toad Scroll. Toad Scroll was the one sitting there the whole fucking time. Oh, I'm so mad now. So I might not get to hidden abilities today, honestly, because of that. I probably won't get to hidden abilities. Um, because Beware was a big answer to this fight. And I don't. I have to figure, I have to re reconstruct my team real quick. So I can try to at least fight this. So I can at least get to hidden abilities next time we stream. And if we lose this fight, we lose this fight. You know what? I don't really care anymore. Fuck, that's so, that's so sad. Beware, I'm so sorry. I forgot in wild battles you can't just fucking run away. You have to be faster. See, that's another mechanic. I wish you can just turn off like easy run away because then I would easily do easy run away every fucking time. I'm not going to deal with losing because I'm not faster than you, bro. That's just a skill issue on my end. That's a big skill issue. That's a fat skill issue, dude. I got to learn. I got to learn. I should have swapped to fucking somebody else right there and just ran away. <laughs> You can't come in. You're weak to fucking Braviary, Molly Wops you. And fucking Fire, Molly Wops you. Serena, Molly Wops you. Like everything, Ice, Molly Wops you. I just have, I have nobody, dude. I Draco Vish, you have to come in, bro. I literally have nobody. Oh my goodness. My team is falling to shambles right now. This battle is so important. This battle is so important, and they have all the fucking answers. They really, they realistically do. They really have all the answers. Those guys really have all the answers. They really fucking do. Like literally, yeah. Okay. Double check you. You're you're going what? You're going plus speed, so I can try to outspeed the Arcanine. It's a it's a speed tie. I need to, I, I need to 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 win that speed tie. You're going this, so I can take out. You still take out our uh, Serena first turn. Easy as that. Hundred percent right. Let me double check this before I just fucking lose my mind. And I go to fight Serena, and I just don't kill her in one hit. Uh, I might not even be able to do this. I might not be able to fight this right now, guys. I should I probably shouldn't even rush this. And I should honestly probably just fucking stop doing this right now and just and just regroup, re like recollect myself and redo this another day, because if I try to do this, I'm gonna lose. We're gonna lose right now because I'm like so I'm so flat, dude. I'm so flustered from losing Beware like that. That's just like it literally just pisses me off to lose him like that. Like literally, I'm annoyed. I don't give a fuck what anyone thinks. That that's that that should not happen. Why do you get the boost? Why I can't get the boost? Why do you? You're a fucking random Zapdos. Out in the nowhere, doing nothing. Oh, it's so annoying. How was I able to kill you then? What the fuck is going on? Oh, because overheat fucking... Oh, I don't even kill Serena in one hit. Oh, because he's little fucking 43, idiot. God damn, boy. I was like, wait a fucking second here. Show me right. Yeah, that's why. Okay, that's exactly right. Serena dies in one hit to a Rodham. Yes, two Madaratum, she dies in one hit in doubles, yes. In doubles, yes. In doubles, yes. Okay, so that's easy to play. 
We captivate. We're going to captivate. Or, uh, if we can't captivate, then we're probably just going to go for, like, recover or something, honestly. As 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 the berry pops, I'll just go for recover. If I can't captivate um, the armor rouge, because he's, if, he, if he's not male, I can't captivate him. Um, you're good. You're good. I need to bring... Who else can come in against this motherfucking... Oh... Honestly, it's gonna be you. It has to be you because you can you can handle the fighting. Yes, if it's Arcanite Armor Rouge, I can probably bring you because you the if Armor Rouge has no boost, the psychic the psychic store power won't do much to me. So I can bring you for Arcanite's backup. You're backup for Arcanite. You're Braviary. You're that. I need I need to bring one more Pokemon. Who do I bring to handle this team? Huh? <laughs> Who do I bring to handle this team? It's like they just have they have literally have all the answers. Oh, uh, I can easily bring you. Once Arcanine's gone and Armor's is gone, I can bring you. But you're just like getting getting to that point. It's not going to be easy. Um, you're weak to the flying. You're weak to the fire. You're weak to the ice. You're weak to. They're just mainly special attackers. So like, I need to be able to. They're special attackers. So I need to be able to handle the special defense shit. Um, like you're not bad at actually. I might bring you. I'm gonna bring Sylveon just on just on a whim because Sylveon is actually pretty decent. Once I get rid of Arcanine and, Ar and Serena, this thing has this thing can wall some stuff. I have I have Light Screen, I have Adaptability, I have Draining Kiss and Helping Hand. I can go for Slight Screens. If I can eat some moves, I can go for Light Screen, eat some moves. I'm not weak to anything they have. I'm weak to Steel, Poison, and that's it. Right. I have really good. I have really had. I have really good special. Uh, but if he goes for if he goes for fucking, huh. he has Psy shock, doesn't he? He has Psy shock, doesn't he? He has Psy shock, doesn't he? No, it's psychic. Okay, we're gonna do this. We're gonna bring this. We're gonna bring Sylveon as a backup because Sylveon's a good backup, honestly. Sylveon is a very good backup for the special attackers. Plus special defense, so minus attack, and you're super good because you have light screen. I honestly could probably start with you instead of my Lodic first turn, which is not a bad thing. That actually is not bad, but then I need you out there for against the fucking... I need some... I need, uh, the Arcanine is so scary. It's just how it is. The Arcanine is so scary. When someone's going to die to the Arcanine. I'm calling it now. I can't do anything about it. Arcanine is literally insane. I'm gonna go plus defense, uh, cause no, I'm gonna go minus special, minus special. I have to, I have to, I have to. Um, for you, I'm gonna go um, same thing. Actually, I'll go special minus speed. Um, Embor, I'll go defense minus special, and then Sylveon, I'll go that. Right? Yes. Um, give you a berry, so you can eat some things, go for Draining Kiss, give you a berry, give you a berry for sure, give you a berry because you have Slack Off as well, so I can Slack Off a turn if I need to. Okay, I think it's a play. Rainbow Berry, first turn, Serena dies with an overheat from this. You can captivate Armor Rouge if he's male, which is perfect. And then, I have, I, I mean, I, this thing's really good too. Um, because once I get rid of the physical tiger, I can bring this thing in, and this thing can just go for light screen, and this thing can this thing can win us a battle. Honestly, it's not very fast, but light screen can come in clutch. Like if Sylveon has to die, Sylveon has to die for light screen to come up, which is why I don't want to start off with it because I guess I could, huh? I'm just thinking if I if I change my Lodic for Sylveon and go for light screen first turn, kill Serena, or Serena's gonna attack one of us. Oh, that's probably not a good idea, though. Um, that's probably not a good idea, because Serena's fast. I don't want to do it. I'll just do this, because I know you can eat the. I know, I know, I know you can eat Serena's moves, so we'll do that, and then we can bring you in once Arcanai's gone. You're for Arcanai. Hammer arm sucker punch. Quite honestly, hammer arm sucker punch is gonna is gonna is gonna is gonna, is gonna get this job done. All right, let's do it. Let's fucking do it. We're gonna beat this battle, and that's the last thing I'm doing. All right, Dookies. It's the last thing I have time for today, so I probably shouldn't even do this, honestly. I probably honestly shouldn't even do this battle. I probably won't do this battle. I know we've been calcing for a long time for this battle, guys, and I probably won't do the battle, though, because 
I'm just saying because I have to, once my girlfriend gets here, my sorry, my girlfriend, my fiance gets here, I have to go. I have to leave. Like I have to immediately like leave. So like I don't have time to like when she gets here to like okay hold on let me finish this battle. I don't have time for that. So I'm just thinking I might just hold off on it and bring back maybe tomorrow, maybe Thursday, um, maybe tomorrow, and I can game with Dookie Boy DB Thursday, Friday maybe. I'll have to see, I'll have to see, because I just don't want to rush it, I don't want to rush it. I got a little flustered because of the fucking, because I lost, I lost Beware. But you're just as good, you're just as good, you're just like Beware, you're just, you're fire. You eat the fire and you eat the rocks, so you're actually better than Beware. You are better than Beware, because you eat both moves he has on him. So, Sylveon's a really good special defensor, once I get rid of both physical attackers, which is Serena, Anna, um, Arcanine. So, it's these two... You're for Basque Legion, you're for Braviary, and you are for Arcanine. You're a backup for the special attackers with light screen. That's a play. I think that's it, guys. So I'm gonna go and I think I'm gonna go and call it here. I'm gonna go and save myself some time. Um, I don't want I don't want to get into it and do this. It's gonna be a short one today. I don't want to mess anything up. You know, I don't want to get in this battle and just my brain go go dumb because I lost Beware and now my brain's like a little scattered brain right now. I'm gonna do that. We'll be able to get in this battle first thing we do. First thing we do next time we play. We'll get into the battle. If anything, I can have a small stream where I, uh, um, what's it called? Like, hop on and play for like an hour, hour and a half maybe. And then I swap over and play something else because I have, if I do this, we immediately hop in. I know I'm rambling. I know I'm rambling. I'm rambling here. I'm rambling here. I'm rambling because I'm rambling here. But no, I'm going to go and edit. I'm going to go and edit. I'm going to go going to the stream. I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to do too much. We've already been live for three hours as well. We've been live for a good amount of time. Um,. Damn, losing Beware. If we don't lose Beware right there, I definitely push forward. But honestly, Embor is pretty. Embor is just as good for Arcanine, so I'm not really mad about that, honestly. Beware is really good, but Arcanine, I mean, but Embor does can do the same thing, so I'm not mad about that anymore. That's totally fine. But I don't have time to do the battle today, so we'll probably come back and do the battle next time. If we beat the battle, then we can go to hitting hidden abilities encounter. We have, a, we have a bunch of encounters to get once we get to the Celadon City. Saffron, Lavender Town, there's over there's a bunch of routes to get encounters from once we once we beat this boss. And then it's a matter of going and fighting Surge, Erica, all that shit. So you got a long road ahead of us, but I'm gonna go and call for today, guys. I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm rambling, I'm rambling too much. But thanks for Bookie Dookie Boys for tuning in. Sorry for getting uh, dookified over beware. I was just not expecting that. Oh, the ancient power boost. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should not have gone for Zapdos. I will learn to not go for legendaries. I wanted to go for Zapdos as desperation. That's exactly why I did it. I wanted, I, I needed help against this fight, and I was like, Zapdos can KO with with electric moves. Zapdos is good. But all right, Dookies, that's gonna do it for today. Thanks for tuning in, Dookie Boy, Dookie Boy, Dookie Boy, Dookie Boy, and we'll see you, Dookies, in the next one.